If your husband is very quiet and is not in the mood to talk or connect with you, how do you bring up his energy to be communicative? Like uh, sometimes you observe he is very dull and you are in good energy and you really want to share something, you want to talk, what do you do? So let me share my personal hacks or secrets, what helps me to communicate with my husband. So generally if I want to talk some serious topic which he doesn't like, I know that he resists such conversations, then what I do is bring up a topic of common interest and start chatting with him. Like my husband is interested in politics or sports, so I just bring up what match is going on, what's the score, something like that, I'll ask him a question and he'll start talking. So once he gets into the talking mode, then gradually it can shift to other topics. So suddenly if I bring up a topic which he is not interested in, he'll normally withdraw and he'll become silent. So this is the way I get him to talk and then move on to the other topics which I want to discuss. So this is hack number one. And hack number two, find something common which you both love to do. For example, I love going on a walk uh, with my hubby in our neighborhood. So we both love this activity. So this becomes a common activity which we both love and we go out and while we walk, I talk like we start talking to each other. So there is no distraction like TV or anything else occupying our mind. So we are just walking and there we talk. So find out in your life what you both enjoy doing. Maybe you both like to cook in the kitchen or uh, Maybe as you clean up something or involving kids, you do something, then you can just start talking. So whatever common activities you do together, if there is a scope to talk, uh, you can just bring up the topics gradually and then start talking, start the conversation. Uh, So this is one hack. So another hack which I personally use is we both like to sit out in the portico. We have a beautiful portico outside our home. So like initial days of marriage that that holds a emotional uh, uh, connect with us. Sitting in the portico was very important for us when we got newly married because we stayed in a small house in a town where summers were very harsh. Uh, entire day used to be very hot. So evening times it, it used to be so cool and windy and we used to just sit in the portico and chat for hours together house was also very small so we spent maximum time in the portico Uh, so now also that brings good memories whenever i call him even though he is totally busy in uh, newspaper or tv or doing something on his own whenever i call him come let us spend some time in the portico he'll easily accept that because it has a common connect for both of us so this is one personal hack so find out in the early days of marriage when you both had a good bonding what really clicked with both of you bring that uh, that same uh, connect back using that what helped you in the early days of marriage so that thing will connect you both again now so try this hack if you have anything like this and thirdly the more we try to get closer this husband they run away So just remain aloof, do your own thing, be happy by yourself. So they'll start wondering what's this new energy and they'll start rising their energy to your level. So this I have observed in my life. So all these things I'm sharing today from my personal experiences like having better understanding and bonding with my husband. I've been married for 33 years now. So what has worked for me, I'm sharing with you. So generally, if we get more clingy and more anxious and trying to pull them into the conversation, uh, husbands will resent it, they will not connect. So better to let them go sometimes so that you can get them closer later. So let them do their own thing, let them enjoy their me time also. And then they will feel like again connecting back with you. So give them that space. I have met many dads also in my coaching journey. Dads have expressed their problems to me. Like they say, I also need my me time. It's not always family time. And how do I get to relax? 
so wives normally resent husbands spending time with their friends or doing their own activities so give them that space husbands main complaint is wives talk too much and i want my alone time i want my quiet time and so give them that space and then they'll come back after a while and in the meanwhile instead of resenting that uh, the fact that he is not connecting with you start uh, taking up your own activities and start having uh, something planned for yourself by yourself you can engage in something else which you love to do so that he will also get his space and then when you both uh, meet back then both of you will be in good energies and will spend quality time with each other these are simple tips from my life i felt like sharing with you hope it is helpful and give me feedback share in the comment what do you think about this husbands trying to maintain distance and you want to uh, get closer and talk and communicate what do you feel about it just share in the comments take care bye